Hello there, friends. Welcome back in, uh, or welcome on. And if you are just joining us today, we are playing some more Stardew. Uh, we have reached uh, day seven of spring year two. We got a potato harvest day. We fixed the greenhouse. We saw a raccoon. I'm very excited about that. <laughs> and we have our Iridium sprinklers and our ancient seeds ready to plant. Like we are, we are prepared for this. We, we're just missing the greenhouse. So I'm really glad that we finally got that. Um, we also may or may not have ordered a Starbucks <laughs> while we were out uh, camera. So Mike's going to be grabbing that whenever that comes in. Uh, so we will be pausing for a minute, but that's okay. Alrighty. Uh, such a help around town since you moved here. Everyone keeps telling me how all the wonderful things you've done for them. Please accept this thank you prize from the mayor. I can tell you've been really good care of your pet. I'm really happy about that, but there are many sweet animals that need a home. If you're interested, I'll start offering pet adoptions at my shop. Uh, just be aware that there's a licensing fee and also that each pet will want their own outdoor pet bowl area. Or else they'll be unhappy. Robin will be happy to construct additional pet bowls for a price. See you soon. Am I also going to get this money? It is time. I think that was from me completing a certain amount of quests. Oh. Um, Pam just sent me a battery pack. I think she asked for one of those in the future. Did you get the pop cats going, friends? Mike is doing the thing. Here, I'll even stand close because it's usually me harvesting, but... I got something to sleep on. <laughs> it's funny because on my screen it looks like you're not even lifting your hands. You're just like telepathically like shuffling forward. There we go. Alrighty, let me let me start up this greenhouse business here, shall we? Hey, hon, do we still need golden potatoes? Because I got like 34 of them already. <laughs> no, we don't, thankfully, but... Okay, so I have the ideal layout right in front of me uh, for the greenhouse. Uh, I'm going to start probably with the two sprinklers on the sides because those ones are... Two. Or um, not obstructing anything, which is great. Should I save some potatoes? Uh, maybe save like a couple, yeah. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, that's a full slot. I'm gonna put down some fertilizer. Don't know if it really matters, but... It has started, chat. <laughs> it has started. And the kale. What about the kale? Save save the kale. Save like five of it. Okay, so there's six. Okay, now I put there's five gold star. Because that's the only gold star. Oh, here. Take the boat. The boat gets moved. Oh. You can put the crystalline right there. Oh, okay. I see. I see. I see what you mean. Yeah, we'll fill these up eventually. But like right now, I will be moving them again. So just leave them. Um, um, I need to plant the rest of the potatoes again. Water. I need my watering can. I guess it's just... Should I just go buy more potatoes and just plant a shit ton of potatoes? Just plant more potatoes. Yeah, that's what I do personally. Oh, this is the only day we're going to have to water these ones at least. Cool. Alright, so let's figure out our tree sapling situation because we weren't entirely sure I don't remember the exact placement for them. But... I have it up in front of me. Okay. Um so I I do know the placement, but it's it's whether or not it's actually gonna work. Uh I don't remember you don't hoe ahead of time, right? You just just plant you just, just plant. smash trees into the ground. Okay. Here I'm gonna be at I'm at Perry's or Pierre's right now. What trees do you want? I want one of each, to be honest. I know it's going to be pricey to do that. Cherry, apricot, orange, peach, <laughs> pomegranate, so... apple. That's it. Okay. Uh, I'll put them in the tool chest. So I think what I'll do is I'll take one of them. Uh, in the tools chest, by the way. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to take an orange one because we already have oranges. We already have the orange tree growing on our farm. And I'm going to use that one as the tester. Because we weren't entirely sure if they would still let you do this. Um, this is saying that this is the ideal spot. 
It still let me plant. Okay, then it works. So we should plant the others? Yeah, it works. That See? It actually put the planting in the ground. It works. Yeah, okay. Apparently, what I was reading online, someone was trying to put it in that bucket in the back. Oh. You can't put it in that bucket. That That's actually a spa space you can't plant in. Got you. But yes, the trees do go along. Or so far, we've seen that they still can go along the outside. It's a op optimal way of getting your fruits, trees, always, all year round. I might need more potatoes. Holy shit. Sorry, I'm just like triple, triple checking. But like I'm planting it in the right spot. Yeah, there are the uh, best spots where you can maximize the greenhouse. Oh, did I buy just enough? I bought just enough seeds. Oh, for the potatoes? Apparently I... Oh, no, I'm, I'm a couple short. Never mind. <laughs> Dang, it's okay. I'm also a little short. Um, <laughs> yours has been growing as well since you checked. Yeah, so I, I think we're good there. So... What other trees do you want, seeing as I bought one of each? Or are you just going to... Oh, I usually just cycle, so if I can get, like, another... I think you can put three of each in the greenhouse. Oh, that was two. It might be two. So, let me count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. I think there's six, so that's three. Oh, okay. I think. If you want to spend the money. If not, it's cool. So, two more of each? Two more of each. And we're not going to worry about the ones that the trees outside, right? Yeah. Two, two, two. Because eventually those ones will be chopped. Two, two, two. Oh. <laughs> so I think it's really funny that you guys can't hear. Same I hear bit. Mike's original voice plus his voice in my headphones from his microphone. So all I heard is two, 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 two. <laughs> All right, thank you, hon. Oh my god, some trout soup out of the garbage. Oh, we gotta get the eggs today, too. Shit. I did not pay attention to what order I planted them, so these are gonna be a little wonky, but that's okay. It, it really doesn't matter what order they're in. It doesn't change how they grow. It's for the aesthetics. And if anyone wants a link to the post that I'm looking at, by the way, let me know. Also, for those who don't, also don't know, the uh, that little water basin that she walked past, that actually does work. You can fill up your watering can from that. Uh, squeaky painting. Welcome on in. Thank you so very much for the raid. How was your stream? Thank you. Thank you. I hope you're so, having a great day. Welcome I on was in. literally one potato short. One short. Jeez. Okay. Great. Hello, friends. Uh, welcome on in. We are just uh, planting our trees in our greenhouse that we just unlocked today. I am very, very happy. It's been a good day. I hope you're having a great one. Uh, what was your... Sorry. What game were you playing? How was your stream? By the way, our chickens have evolved. Yeah, your chickens. Just the duck remains not evolved. Okay. Also, I'm sorry. Is your profile icon a capybara? I love capybaras. I need. I, wait, wait, wait. I don't know if I'm already Ollie, following you. Ollie, fucking move, Ollie. Come on. I got fucking move. There we go. Okay, greenhouse is settled. Bear with. Bear with. Am I following you? That's, that is how you win over a crystal. Yeah. Capybaras are how you do it. Am I already following? There we go. Now I am. Now I am. There we go. Sorry for some reason. So I hope I did it right. You did. Yeah. You did art stream where I planted Lugia and Dark Lugia. Oh, that's very cool. I hope the art stream went amazing. Thank you so very much for the raid. Thank you for the follows dropping in as do well. You know, it's kind of funny. What? There's no road today. There's no road today? Yeah. We got very lucky. <laughs> um... 
But thank you, thank you, thank you. And if you all need to read and run or anything, feel more than free. But if you want to hang out here too, that's cool. If anyone is new, my name is Chris. I'm playing at some uh, Stardew Valley 1.6 update with my partner, Mike. And um, we just entered year two. It's been a good day. I could spend 6,000 on a mining monthly. Oh, is that good? It's just mining experience. It's up to you. You can send it if you'd like. I can get that just by mining. It's no point. Hi hey Shane, you look unusually happy today. You're right, I haven't felt this light since I was a kid. Oh my god. Okay, what are your stats right now? I'm in a cutscene, so I can't check. <laughs> okay, well, let's pause then. Haha. <laughs> uh, let me guess. Gus had a clearance sale on canned beer. Good one. Oh, poor Shane. <laughs> No, actually, I've been drinking sparkling water instead of beer, and I feel great. You know, I sometimes forget that I really do have friends, people that care about me. And it's okay for me to rely on them. It doesn't make me weak. That sounds like a weak person talking. <laughs> Michael, he's... Don't listen to him, please. Jess, I've got something for you. Oh. I don't know, I got a notification. I thought you had my phone. Okay, well, my game's paused. Okay. We're gonna hang tight for just a second, friends. We ordered a, uh, a Starbucks to come in, so... We're paused right now, anyway. Shane has such a good story. Yeah, he's... He's a very interesting character. And I always try to befriend him pretty early, as well. Epic battle in Water Dark League. Yeah, versus Lugia in Markers. That's very, very neat. It's very neat. I love... I have a soft spot for Lugia from Pokemon XD. Gale of Darkness, so... But yeah, how's everyone's day going? While we're just kind of vibing, while we're waiting for Mike to get back. Probably should have muted him while he's getting up. You probably just heard all the grunts and stuff. <laughs> Which is fine. Um, but usually I'm better about... Let me see here. There's a cat cafe game and there are capybaras in it. Oh, really now? Now you got my interest. Love the second generation as a kid. Oh, you don't have Gale of Darkness? I hope you can get your hands on it one day. It's one of those ones that's like, you know, it, Pokemon games don't really go down in price. <laughs> they go up. Um, but I hope you can play it one day. It's fun. I've never finished it. I've never finished it. It's one of those childhood games that I played a lot of, but I never really got too far. Uh, but yeah, Gen 2 is one of my favorites as well. Um, also, I can't remember if I mentioned already, but if you have not already, scroll up in chat, friends. Drop squeaky painting a pop if you would like to. Sounds really cool. It's like 200 bucks. Yeah, easily. Easily. <laughs> Um, I'm happy I still have my childhood copy. It's one of those games that I, I don't want to get rid of or lose or anything. Um, and if anyone's curious as well, I saw Earthwind Firefox uh, do the mod command. Um, we were doing mod lists the first year. I have now added in a, one mod, <laughs> just one, um, for my own save file where uh, it allows us to kind of manipulate time in multiplayer, so instead of it continuing to chug forward while we're in cutscenes like this one, um, if both players are paused in something that would other- or doing something that would otherwise pause during single player, like the fishing minigame, opening menus, entering cutscenes, changing screens, um, the game will pause, which is very, very nice. It's, it gives me some breathing room. It allows us to pause a bit easier. So. Bunny jewel slippers. They're not describing the version, they're describing what it costs to buy one. It costs one diamond and one pearl. <laughs> one ruby and one sapphire. That's funny. I hadn't heard that one before. But yeah, no, they're... They're pricey. Uh, did you guys tend to get rid of games? Did you guys keep your your existing games? I've only gotten rid of, I think, two games off the top of my head. Uh, and they both went to people who wanted them. My friends. 
um, who would enjoy them a lot more than I would. You have yours still. I gave away um, a somehow, I don't know who gifted it. it was, I think it was one of those things where it's like someone knew that I had a GameCube, but they had no idea what I was enjoying uh, or what I would like on it. So they got me a, I think a WWE game on the GameCube. <laughs> I just remember you could hit people with chairs in it. Um, I've never watched wrestling in my life. I have no idea about it. Um, but someone decided that was a great gift for a nine-year-old crystal. Um, and I gave that to a friend who was really into wrestling. He was much more interested. So I'm like, here, take it. I don't want it. Um, and then the other one I gave away, which I kind of regret, but I also don't, was the first Rune Factory because I tried it and I didn't like it at all. Um, came back years later with Rune Factory 4 and loved it. So, like, it's one of those things I wish I hadn't given away. But also, he, the guy I gave it to, absolutely fell in love with the series. He went on to play all the other games. Like, it was a good thing. You know? So. And now I can just steal Mike's copy of Rune Factory 1. So. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Got rid of a few, and I went back and rebought them because I regretted it. Yep. Yeah. Me and mom have been thinking of installing one of those time mods. Play, this one's been really good. This one's been very good. Era simulator with the chair. God, they they did a lot right in Remake and Rebirth. And yeah, Era is this amazing and very funny. Just making sure I'm caught up with chat. Got my G Fuel, but uh, it's running low, so it's like a very, very diluted G Fuel today. Which is why we need the coffee. <laughs> How far have you gotten in Rebirth? I'm still Chapter 10. I did not play it all this weekend. I think I booted up once, took a look at it, and I'm like, I'm just gonna wait. And again, it's not Mike's fault. <laughs> this is a me thing, but. Mike has a habit of talking while I'm playing and like I just need to focus I need to like just zone in and focus and like hear everything the characters are saying and stuff um and Mike's not used to that because usually I play a lot of games where like you know it's Minecraft there is no voice lines and stuff like that or Stardew even um so I don't have to worry about him talking over gameplay so he's going home tomorrow <laughs> uh, I'm gonna be playing probably all week um and I'm, I'm looking forward to it, I'll be honest. There is! Yeah, I got my MoMA drink. Last two chapters, you definitely need to listen to everything. Yeah, exactly. That's why I'm just kind of like, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll hang tight. It'll be a... Uh, uh, a good feeling when I finally get to it. Everything good? Oh, Mike's just bringing my mom her drink. She, uh, she doesn't really experiment. She kind of finds, like, one drink that she really likes, and she doesn't really try anything else, which is fair. I do the same thing a lot, but, um, the only thing she ever gets from Starbucks is the caramel apple spice drink, which I'm glad is not just, like, a fall drink <laughs> for her sake. Uh, but it is tasty, so I can see why she likes it. I was talking about my mom's drink choice. <laughs> you do yeah, Mike nearly threw her drink on her the other day. <laughs> that wasn't good. My husband's like that. He likes what he likes, yeah. But. Uh-huh. Because I got whipped cream on top. <laughs> yeah. I'm happy now. Oh. Sorry, I didn't think that was going to be too loud in the microphone. I think it was. Thanks, getting straws. There we go. I don't know about where you all are, but our Starbucks here, obviously they've transitioned over to like paper straws. Uh, but their paper straws are like dyed green. Most god awful straws. I have a, I have a hatred for paper straws. Don't get me wrong, paper straws, I, I, I get why we're doing it, but like, you know, d getting, like, dyeing them green? No. Thank you. 
Makes it even worse. Oh, nice affection and joy. Okay. I may take that off. There we go. Yeah, that's a good copy. There are way better solutions available. Uh, take two, buying gearbox is super weird. Not really for Borderlands. Uh, 2K was already publisher as far as I know, and they mentioned Duke Nukem in the announcements if there's... That's in any way a valuable IP. Weird. Just cost more money for Starbucks. I bought a pack of glass straws I use instead of plastic ones they give. Yeah, we, um, we have these metal ones which we use at home, and then we have collapsible metal ones which we use on the go sometimes if we remember there we go all good no not good oh they all the grunts and stuff for me I know <laughs> I don't know if they did because you didn't tell me to mute as you were getting up and I forgot, but... Oh, so everybody heard me going, trying to get into the seat, um, which yes. my seat is actually just where I lay on my bed and my laptop overhangs that, so... I just I just realized looking down at my laptop, I gotta be very careful because if that ethernet cord pops out, I'm gonna be DC'd. Oh, that would suck if it was. Or if it did, I should say. But, uh... On the topic of paper straws, if you actually look at like reports and stuff, they're finding more and more that the glues and the processes that they've been going through to make these straws are not only more harmful to the, to the environment than the plastic straws that they were they were trying to replace, but they're also causing like all these like cancer cause uh, carcinogenics throughout the body because they're just drinking so much of that garbage through it. Not and good. my final point on it is if you run a comp campaign off of a certain, you know, images and stuff, you better sure hope that those images are exactly what you need them to be. Because all those images you saw of turtles with straws up their nose were fake. Those were turtles getting procedures done. Those straws were put in so the turtles can breathe. Apparently. So... so yeah, there's no way a paper straw is going to get in a turtle's nose. Or a plastic straw is going to get into a turtle's nose. Maybe his throat, not nose. I guarantee you that much. Anyways. There's Mike's little soapbox. Yep. Um, at least Embracer said it's too early to start buying stews again after selling off a bunch. <laughs> Alright, you guys ready to continue with the cutscene? Kind of tried to pour a little jazz here. Uh, these are real bunny jewel slippers. Oh, was the cutscene over right after? <laughs> but these are so expensive. How did you afford them? I've cut back on expensive habit. I have a lot more spending money now. Oh, do we want a tea sapling? What about it? Oh, I think I'm having a blue chicken cutscene. Okay, but I can buy a tea sapling. I think I can make them. You can make them? Yeah. That's why I was befriending Caroline. Uh, Uncle Shane's in the barn. He said, uh, he said to tell you he wants to show you something. Are y'all ready for our blue chickens? Why aren't we planting trees? Or tea saplings? Takes 20 days to mature, produces tea leaves during the final week of each season, except for winter. No water necessary. Because I heard that they were kind of nerfed. Oh, we can still plant them, but like I heard mind. they were nerfed. If it's garbage, it's garbage. You know what's still paused for me? I'm still in, in a cutscene. I didn't realize it stayed paused. I'm trying to read. <laughs> My love. <laughs> that should do it. I want to get our blue chickens. This is what I've been aiming for. Jojo couldn't get his hands on them, but we have succeeded. This is one of my absolute favorite portraits in the game, by the way, is Shane holding a chicken that just is really happy looking. Perfect home for you hens. Of the best eggs in the whole valley. Fresh and healthy with rich gold yolks, not like those pale, sickly Joja eggs. Oh. You know, Charlie, I was just thinking. 
girl like me is always teetering on the edge of despair, know what I mean? But you and the other hens are gonna keep me upright from now on, I know it. This little hen's like, excuse me. What's wrong? Too much pressure? Not to be dramatic, but I would die for Charlie. We've had Charlie here for like five minutes, and if anything ever happened to him. <laughs> or her. Them. They're a cutie. Hey, Crystals, what do you think? I think I would like a blue chicken, please. My special blue hens, I've been raising them in secret for the last few months. I, well, I don't, I won't be living here forever and I want to pass something on to Jazz. I've been teaching her how to care for them. I want to feel like I'm not just a leech on the world. I want to contri uh, contribute somehow, even in a small way like this. The hell's the wizard catalog too? Oh. I know we had Marnie's catalog earlier, so maybe it's similar. The wizard's catalog is 150,000 and you buy it from Krobus. Interesting. M. Rasmodius this is private furniture collection. Oh. That's interesting. Should I buy a void egg? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, no, money wasn't there. Yeah, buy it. Why not? We spent a lot of money today, but it'll all come back to us. I was yeah. going to go and buy a blue chicken, then I realized she wasn't even there. You don't need her to be there. You can buy her stuff <gasps> without her there. Right. You're just talking about the catalog. Dun, 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 powers. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Come on. No. <laughs> this is all you. <laughs> it's your solo. No, but like, why? You gotta remember your powers. We just talked about having magical powers the other day, okay? Not ram, but you can still make a purchase using the animal catalog. Purchase animals. Give me that blue chicken. So if you're ever curious, by the way, I know this worked before. I don't know if it works now. Um, at the bot, at the top, sorry, it'll say choose a coop for your new blank chicken. It'll tell you the color. Um, if you exit in and out, at least it used to let you change color. Oh, maybe it doesn't anymore. Maybe they fix that. Oh, maybe they did fix it. Wow. No, tr just keep on trying. You might just have bad luck. I'm going to exit out all the way. It still works. Was I just getting really bad luck? They really want me to have a brown chicken. Brown. <laughs> I swear I'm not liar, chat. Brown. <laughs> Okay, this isn't... You might have to wait till tomorrow. I wonder if it's because wait, she is go to the not chickens. here. Go to the chickens again, though. Oh, I can't see it online. I thought, I thought the blue chicken had its own category. No, no, I remember it being like this. Okay, then just keep mashing till you get your blue chicken. No, no, I'm, I'm going to wait until tomorrow. But what I will do... Is it just these kids? Oh, there's puppies. <gasps> there's very expensive turtles. Turtles? Turtles. 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 There's a very expensive turtle. Why are you so expensive? I want What's you. What's this? Oh. We need the green turtle with the purple shell. Okay, yeah, I guess. What's that? That's What color the... ninja turtle has the purple headband? It's Donatello. Okay. I'm going <laughs> to name him Donatello. I don't, I don't watch ninja turtles. I have no idea. Did you see how fast I got that one? That was easy. Gotta, gotta get, I'm gonna it. laugh so hard when someone's like, "No, you're wrong." <laughs> it's not Don Donatello is purple, Michelangelo is orange, Raphael is red, and Leonardo is blue. All right, that's, okay, that's their colors. If they change them in the past, like God knows when, they they go to hell. Okay, I don't care. <laughs> I, I can even back. tell you their weapons too. With my salad, I see cute pet trolls. Yes, you do. It's a good I'll eat. Ollie move. Oh, it's like IRL. I move. had that exact thing. When the when the kegs are done, actually, you know what? I'm gonna work on that now. I'm gonna put down a path here and put down all the kegs and shit in, in like this area. I'm gonna incubate our, our void monster. Okay. Uh what path did I I didn't want to use any of these, but I guess I don't really have a choice. I could use these. Maybe. Oh, I made too many. Okay. Incubating the monster. It's funny, at 7 p.m. inside the barn, the lights started going dark outside. Mm -hmm. I come outside, it's still bright. <laughs> it's like it's programmed for, like, winter. Oh. This is going to be funny. What? Oh, you need to move. Yeah, please do. I'll wait until you're done. There, plant them. 
Yeah, put your side rocks down, please. I, I don't have any. I need the... I need the, the... Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why wouldn't you make enough? I didn't count. <sighs> put it back. Thank you. It's not connected to anything, by the way. Gosh darn it! Why? <laughs> why, why are we? Are why have we failed it so still? hard? I need. Oh, this takes clay. Yeah. Oh, I chose the wrong path. <laughs> Whoopsies. All right. Well, we won't have too much more of this then. Uh. No wonder I don't use this path. Here, let me move this one up. Oh my god, why'd you stay in the way? I'm I'm putting this one to where I want it. Oh, fuck's sakes. Okay, go. There we go. Actually, why don't we just keep them all in a line? They're all gonna be still in the same line, it's just we can no, access can, it from the other side. You can literally keep them in a straight line. You think? I know so. Alright, if you say so. So you wanna put them all in that line there? No, well, if I were putting them in a line, we're going to have them somewhere else. Where are we? There we go. Okay. One. There we go. This is some some organization. See, watch. When I put it back down, it pulls diagonally. Okay, cool. So cool, you, cool. Can, you can theoretically have chests here, 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 and here. Okay. There we go. This has been like something I've wanted to do for so long. <laughs> this is so nice. It's finally our time, chap. Where are you moving all that stuff? Onto oh. the brick. Okay. Where it belongs. Crystal fruit jelly. What, my jelly? What? It sells for $4.90. That's not bad. That's sure more than more. double the price of that thing. Mm -hmm. uh, these will be moved eventually, but of course we're going to probably get a shed or just empty out Mike's house <clears throat> to put those in there. <laughs> it's going to be the... Uh, uh, I'm blanking. Shit. No, it's not going to be shit. The next potato harvest, I've got to... I'm going to take over one of these sprinklers. Coffee. Oh, yeah, sure. Why Spring not? and summer it grows. We do have some coffee. You know? I know. So I'm waiting. Uh, where did I put that? Unless you want to give me an iridium sprinkler and I'll just do coffee with that. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Oh, God. I'm going to pick up that other one when it harvests as well. Which one? The... Oh, the crystallarium? Yeah. Okay. You know when you hit it, it just spits out a diamond now, right? I know, but I feel like it's been harvesting for a while. Yeah, I don't have the... If you have the uh, info suite or whatever it you is... Can you can hover just, over it. Yeah, I'll tell you how long it's got. And check, yeah. We can move this one now and put a thing under it. Oh, please, yes. Uh, you have to craft the pathways. I don't know what you're doing. I already have one. Okay, where should I, where's the bait bin? Just put it, like, down here somewhere. Well, it's because we got the fish bait here, so I'm putting the worm thing there. That makes sense. I hope it does. Hopefully. Okay. Um, I gotta sell oh. the cheese. Who is calling me at 1230 at night? It's, <laughs> it's the maple syrup bear. Really? Sniff, sniff. <laughs> is that you? I have some of that good sauce still, friend. It's making me very, very happy, snort. Just want to thank you. Bye-bye, friend. He's enjoying the maple syrup. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting that same thing. Scene. <laughs> you like my hat? Uh, come up here so I can see. Oh yeah, it's very fancy. It, it's a privateer hat. I found it. Oh, I can make kegs now. Mm -mm. Yeah. Oh yeah. I want to know your stats because I'm literally eight in everything except oh, I'm for not. fishing. Bear with. Oh, and forging's five. The only type of midnight call I will accept. I am 10 farming, 7 mining, 9 foraging, 9 fishing, 6 combat. 
Oh, so you're actually further ahead than me then, because I'm eight farming, eight mining, five foraging, fishing's done, and combat's eight. I think you've been a little bit more, like, consistent with your levels, whereas I've just been focusing on certain things. Okay. Have you ever looked at it inside the, the stash box where we have all our clothing and stuff and just go to like rings is just like glug 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 I know we have a lot we probably shouldn't like we don't need that many okay tree or tree house yes just greenhouse is looking good rem remember when you're putting stuff away in the bins now uh it goes mining then random junk and then fishing because we changed the order oh I oh that is a wild tree I think interesting did you plant this here did not plant anything can cut you can cut it um, or you can put your mushroom thing next to it. I was going to put the now. greenhouse up here, right? Um, I don't... I have no idea what I was saying. Does the maple syrup get him high? I think it does. I think it does. I am not a maple syrup enjoyer, unfortunately. It's all for him. Oh, right, with the chest. I just pay attention to color. That's how I... Like, I don't think about it. God, that is a weird noise. Um, so omelet, we're nearly there. There's seven days left. We're gonna get that definitely. Fresh fruit. This one's not happening yet. Uh, I guess just more foraging and fishing. Yeah, once we get... I think once we do the first harvest of strawberries, I might want to upgrade the barn. The barn? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. Because, obviously, truffle pigs are broken, so... Yeah. At least they used to be. They won't be there until, I think, the third upgrade, though. Oh, so... I believe. It's gonna be, like, a, a while. Second. Uh... I can check. It's, like, goats and sheep, and then... Yeah, uh, goats and ostrich for the second. Ostrich? Yeah, Mike hasn't seen the ostrich yet. Oh, we might be able to do ostrich. Um, who are you... Who are you, uh, let's say, romancing right now? Uh, I was Ooh. working on Marnie, Lewis. Lewis. Uh, that's it, really. Wizard, I guess. Uh, did you get... You missed Sunday. What? Lewis's birthday. Oh, I'm so close with him. I didn't think it was really worth it to, like... Go okay. And we do still have one of those special teas left. I was waiting for like someone who I just don't really bother with or their gifts are annoying. I like how I walked into my house and it's actually very clean in there. I thought I left it as like a chaos like I normally do. Do you want to try putting, I think the, no, the casts aren't empty right now, are they? They're what? No, they're not empty. Or the kegs, sorry. Yeah. You literally just filled them, I think, yesterday. Right. That'll take a while then. Never mind. So I haven't seen anything else with the raccoon. We'll see. I want the raccoon. <laughs> Maybe something has to happen. Okay. Got you. I don't know. Like, I'm literally saying maybe something has to happen. I don't know. I know I'm level 70, but I'm still nervous about this fight. To put into reference, Brandon, I don't think I was anywhere close to that. Like, I was much lower level, and I did fine. You got this. What? For Persona 5. Royal. Okay. Mike is not like. Oh, we can accept another quest. Oh. Okay. Uh, a hundred pieces of bone or a dozen leeks for George. And it's like picking up leeks or just give him leeks. Picking them up. It takes. It's twenty-one days. I think I might be able to do that. Um. Maybe. If you want. I have no clue how we're gonna do the bone one. Yeah. Unless it gives us a better chance. Let's try this. So, downside is, is that I... Wait, is this a leak? The leaks are like the like little green stems with like white on the bottom. 
Okay, there's a leak here I can't harvest. Oh. It's right before the exit of, Mar of uh, Robins. Okay, I'll, I'll head up there. I'll head up there. I'm just going to look around. Because it works anyway, because I want to, you know, do my foraging. Yeah, I can't even pick that one up. That's weird. It's broken. Oh, there's one next to his house, too. Okay, I got that one. Don't don't pick him up. I I can't remember if I have double harvest or not. No, I don't. Never mind. We're all good. Yeah, but that's max foraging, huh? I thought that was iridium quality. Oh. Then we both have double foraging then. I could pick up the one outside, Robins. Okay. Yeah, I have double chance of getting foraging too. That's level five. Mm okay. Getting tons of SP recovery items because you never know. You got this. I believe. What's this? Persona again. <laughs> Mike's like, what? SP, what's that? I only know Stardew. Don't hit the trees. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna go and probably regret my decisions. Are you gonna go attempt fate? I am. See, it's going to be a bad time. Yeah, considering I went in there with a combat of uh, eight. And with a galaxy sword. And with a galaxy sword, yeah, I'm screwed. <laughs> this should be fun. I think that sword actually has more weight to it. So you might actually be able to hit them back further. Crystals just build different. <laughs> I often think that, yeah. but it's not for good reasons. So the one the one problem I'm having with the galaxy sword, it has no weight behind it. So when you hit them, there's zero knockback. Maybe the hammer is actually better for you then. Yeah. But this hammer would take if I were to get the hammer now, we would have 10k left. So, I will wait. I remember just coming in here one day with a tractor. <laughs> Bunny rabbit today in my backyard. The first time seeing one this year. Oh! That's so cute. It's so funny because, like, I grew up with family members who had, like, gardens in their backyards. So rabbits in your backyard is, like, a bad thing for us. No, no. Bunnies are good. They eat your gardens. No. <laughs> just no. I think I remember doing this the first time. I always just try to, like, pull one enemy at a time. There we go. Try to get his attention so he comes towards me and then back off and wait. Did you run around the forest already? Uh, not fully around it. Okay. I'm doing that now for leaks. It's helping my foraging level too, considering I'm picking up all the forgeables. I don't like that there's two of them. Okay, we're fine. One I can handle. I'm like sorry, she does a multi-dimensional cat. I feel like I'm forgetting something. There's two on top of each other on that side there. Hmm. What? I'm just homing to what you're saying. Oh. Oh, that guy dropped rock candy. Heck yeah. might be the coward's way but but yeah i think other than the galaxy sword this is the best sword we have on us it is i just got two relaxed fit pants out of that guy nice hello friend Oh, 
There we go. Golden sight. See the sight. Nice. Oh wait, we're done with the row. I can actually get the thing I wanted for that thing now. Do you want to put in the lava eel? Yeah. Oh, why are there so many of them over here? I'm going back the way I came. Screw this. I don't remember there being another area over there. It's just a big place to get bones and stuff, but it's dangerous what in there. What's with the drops in this place? I just had someone drop, one of the skulls drop two aquamarine rings. I don't know, hon. You're hacking, aren't you? I'm sorry. Sh I gotta admit it. Share the hacks. Share. <laughs> Sharing is caring. I I ran to the top of the our farm and I forgot about our quick travel. I always forget about that too, to be fair. I can't wait till we move these goddamn kegs. I know, I know. It's a, it's an annoying location. I think I might do a little bit of extra pathing work as well, just to add some more space. Um, on my old farm, I had like a two wide path, and then on either side, I had an additional path. So it takes up four spaces total. It's not really necessary. But nothing goes there. Nothing gets spawned. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm just gonna go check out by the bathhouse. If it wasn't so late, I'd say go move the greenhouse now. With the greenhouse? You said you wanted to move it. Oh, yeah, no, no, too late, too late. I saw Bonnie. It was most certainly not a Dave. Okay, there's like nothing up here. Cool. We are at 3 out of 12. That's not too bad. And like we have 21 days to do it. And we have 17 out of 24 for Gus. We'll get it. Ollie, I swear to God. Move. <laughs> exactly, yeah. It's been one day. We got this. In before, no more leaks. Yeah, really. For the rest of the season. Oh, actually, we could always just plant a spring forageable bundle. True, that would be a good way to do it too. We do have room in the greenhouse. Plenty of it. I wish there was like an auto button on controller. You could just hit to auto deposit things, but you have to like scroll all the way over each time. It's like I see that you have two silver star quality um, leaks in there right now. I also want to say we should take those out and put regular quality ones in. Oh, I mean, you could. I just got a decorative trash can. Oh. Thanks, decorative trash can. You fish it out of the uh, fountain in the middle of the town. Mm-hmm. Also, if you want to fish up trash for that one thing for Linus, you might be... I got another decorative trash can out of this thing. Now we got two. Actually, tap right bumper. And it will automatically bring the cur... <gasps> wait, does it? What? Wait, 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 wait. Well, you may have just changed my... Wait, why am I holding two red mushrooms? Bear with you. may have just changed my life. What is this question? It's not a question. It's an answer. You've just changed my life. I've been playing Stardew with controller for years. <laughs> Sorry, what? Right oh. bumper will Automa automatically bring it. Oh, okay. You have the chat in front of you, Hada. <laughs> Play for the win. Oh my it god. It wasn't chat. Sorry, your chat 
is not been texted onto the screen, so no, it's not in front of me. I can't hear what you're saying. What? You. Oh, you couldn't hear what you. I was on about. I could not hear you. I, we need to get a petition to, to fund a new headset for Mike that has a better microphone on it and um, is not so deafening and heavy. This man can't hear me. Oh my goodness me. You, the way you've just changed my Stardew Valley life right now. Excuse me, who's calling at 11? Hey, Crystal. Lewis, what? I just wanted to check up on you and see if Tater Farm is doing well. How's everything going? Good. I really feel at home here. Good. The farm is very productive. Not so good. I know your secret, Lewis. I know your secret, Lewis. What's, What's that? that? I think the line cut out. I can't hear a thing. All right. Well, I guess I'll hang up then. Bye. Aw, you chose the same one I did. <laughs> We had done the other one before, so. There we go. You have, do you got two of the pair of pants I have on? Yeah. Hey, Haynes. Oh, thank you so very much for watching those. I'm glad. Yeah, the Stardew Valley episodes are going out now. Um, and I have been keeping up with uploads, so <laughs> that's been good. I hope you've been uh, having uh, a good week, if not a crazy one. Or wait. I hope it's been a good crazy. There we go. Okay, it is uh, the 9th. It's Vincent's birthday tomorrow. Strawberry harvest day. Uh, Clint sent me a iron bar. Oh, our first iridium milk. Nice. Quack. I heard duck. Yep, it's fully grown now. This chest needs to move. Our void chicken is still incubating. That's okay. He'll get there. Hey, Omni, how are you doing? Gus's omelet needs two more eggs. Two more? Wow. Getting there. Considering that Ooh. day we got five eggs, yeah. Blue Jazz Hoppy. You want to see if Marnie will give you the uh, blue chicken today? Oh, yes, I will check that. And I also... Oh, wait, no. Oh, no. It's Tuesday. So? It is a day for her to go to... She doesn't need to be there. Yes, but I ran into this last time, hon. I was thinking it was only giving me brown chickens. And I think it's because of the catalog. You need to harvest strawberries. I will. Okay. I just, I have a suspicion that it was acting funny for that reason. That's all. We're blue chicken at though. We're working on it. We're working on it. It'll happen. I will go try again, however. I'm also going to try to make some more of uh, the beehives here. Right, nine o'clock. I will wait. I will sit and wait. I like how harvesting with mouse and keyboard, all I do is just I hold my right click and I just wave my cursor. <clears throat> I'm done. Uh, do you want me to save any? Oh, I'll save five of the regular strawberries. Yeah, save a couple. Um, I just got a white chicken. White chicken. Today might just be white chicken day. Brown? No, it did change. There you go. We're good. It did change. Wait. Give me the blue chicken. Just blue. Be patient and just keep going. I'm I'm naming this one blue. Oh. Um you know what? All caps, yeah. Show the excitement. 
I'll send little blue right to her new home right away. You gotta yell it when you say it. I wonder if I just had really, really bad luck the other day then. I think it's just a whole lot of wild assumptions. I mean, true. Sega Mega Drive. I love going back to that game. Oh, that's cool. That's always neat, playing on, like, original hardware as well. <gasps> Your essay's done, Rosie. Nice. Okay, uh, did you sweep around the forest yesterday? Yes. Okay. I'm doing it again right now. Okay, cool, cool. I'll leave it then. I'm gonna go check up uh, into making some more beehives. Uh, and I guess I might end up going mining here. Uh, just to get some more resources for that. Okay. I guess it's next week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday is when uh, the desert festival. I think so. I'm excited to see what that's all about. Oh, Max ranks the soldier all oh, his final um final uh I'm blanking. Uh cutscene thing is really cute. Oh hun, I just heard you teleport and it really concerned. I'm always forgetting to use it, so oh I see the little baby blue chicken. Little blue chicken. Uh oh we need more maple syrup. Okay. Why? For beehives. Oh. We got three. Okay. So uh, I can make one tapper, two, two tappers, three beehives. <laughs> Take the rest of the day to relax and focus. Sorry, and tomorrow I'll focus on cracking and make sure I answer everything. Very nice. I hope you enjoy your day. Do you have any plans? Gonna hang out? Play some Dew of the Stars? coming over tonight, so I'll try to make them play. Oh, nice! <laughs> Sounds like fun. I don't think I purchased uh, a catalog for Robin. No, I didn't. Okay. I just want to move this uh, this greenhouse. It's like I'm keeping count. <laughs> keeping count. <laughs> oh dear. This is off topic, but I feel the need to share. I got my taxes sorted this morning. 
And by this morning, I mean they actually sorted it like two days ago, but I didn't check my email. I went from like a stress level of like, let's say like maybe like 75 down to like 30 <laughs> overnight, just like that. It's like, oh, it's done. It's good. Good. <laughs> you could, Rosie. You could, but I think that's what he wants. <laughs> so. You did them this morning as well. God, I hate doing them. I hate it so much. Or, I mean, don't do it. <laughs> like your second grade. So your second grade would want to get in trouble. Oh, I love that mining. And then they get in trouble and cry. <laughs> Same. <laughs> Sounds like me. See, random, I just assumed you were saying sad because you're not getting banned. And like that, it was it was its own message and I understood it. What are you up to in game, huh? Fishing. Fishing. You're mining, so I'm gonna fish. True, true. Earn some extra money. I figure I was just gonna try to get more iron because I'm gonna blow through it on uh, kegs and uh, okay. beehives. I think tomorrow I'll probably go into the mines. Okay. I'll go into the deeper floors. I'll start at 90. Yeah. I'm going to try to get my mining up. Mining in combat. I've already maxed out fishing. So. I have to become way of the five. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, we want to see what's behind that door. I know. Kind of know what's behind it. <gasps> I know a brief bit about it. That's why... You might have been, might have been looking at things. I just skimmed and I saw something. I'm like... Ugh. Word sad. Now it doesn't seem like a word to me. I had that a couple of years ago. I can't remember what it was, but I was writing the word purple a lot. And I had a moment, I'm like, is this actually, like, is this a thing? Is this a word? So it is to be an emo kid of the early 2000s. <laughs> is this real? Who am I? <laughs> is this real life? Or is it just fantasy? Is this just fantasy? Hand over all your oranges. Caught in a landslide. No escape from reality. See, the funny thing is, Crystal has no clue half those lyrics, so. Oh no. I know that part. The entire song? Nah. No, nah, no clue, but most of it. Now the real question is, chat. Yeah, see, see. If you had to recite a song and get it, let's say ninety-five percent right, I'll be nice and not say a hundred percent. How about this first? What is the title of that song? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead. Um. Oh, I got a note. Um. If you which song would you pick? Because here's the thing, right? Mike's found out this about me very recently. I listen to music, but I don't really hear lyrics all that well. Um, it's just like in one ear out the other. I don't hear them. I hear the music, I hear the beat, but I can't hear the words usually. Oh Bowling for Soups 1985. I have the entire thing memorized somehow. I love that. But yeah, if you had to pick one song that you could recite hands down. Bad touch. I was gonna say one of the Disney songs for me, probably. Nah, hands down, Bad Touch by Bloodhound Gang. Yeah. I would love to know those lyrics at the back of my hand. <laughs> uh. Happy birthday. Oh, you know, okay, you know, I, I set the bar too low. I set the bar too low. <laughs> Good answer, though. Don't stop me now. The whole queen discog 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 
Discography, yes. Thank Disc you. Discography. Ah, shit. Oh, just saved that fish. It was sitting at the bottom and my bobber bounced so hard Aww. off the bottom. But I saved it. And I caught it because he had a chest. Church songs from when I was a kid. Am I allowed to sing along? I'd say I'd give you the music, but it wouldn't have any lyrics. So you would have to do the lyrics. I guess I'm just going to head back. So we don't have to sing a cappella then. Yeah, no, fuck that. <laughs> Can I sing auto tuned though? If you wanted to. All right. The poke. Okay, I couldn't do the Pokemon rap, but the Pokemon theme song. Which like Maybe. the full rap or just at the end of each episode? Rap? No, no. Rosie's saying like the full thing. Because I had one of them almost memorized. I think my favorite is that I will say certain Pokemon's names the way that they say it in the rap. Like and War Turtle. War Turtle. I will never stop. <laughs> I also. I hey, look don't it, know. I caught a Charmeleon. Charmeleon. <laughs> I don't know um, which version of Pokemon I was watching as a kid, but I didn't know about the Pokemon rap until I was in my teens. It was just not a thing on the end of my VHS tapes or whatever. Is this a Pikachu? <laughs> I have loads, but the one I'm confident in is share value. Okay. Okay. I, I like that that one. There's like a, I can't remember if it was College Humor or some joke website was making fun of um, people playing Pokemon Go and like non-Pokemon fans playing Pokemon Go. And it was like the guy's like, oh yeah, you know, I found an onion turtle over there. I found some, some land dicks there. And oh, that's Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> And then like, there's another person like, this guy's pissing me off. He's doing this intentionally. He's not even saying the names correctly. The onion turtle? Come on. Bulbasaur. It's not that hard. Onion turtle. <laughs> yeah, big, <laughs> big dig <laughs> beetle. <laughs> uh, it's yeah. funny. Aha, there we go. I'm just not hitting the buttons right. Oh, Aerodactyl's right. another Slow one I'll punk. say. <laughs> Slow poke, yeah. All right, guys, that's just a little portion of the rap, and we're going to come back next time. We're going to do the rest of it. Come on now. <laughs> so good. She'll be love Maroon 5. Oh, yeah. Yep. Oh, no, tomorrow I'm going to go get the lava eel. That's what my adventures for tomorrow is, is Lava Eel. I am going to look up what Vincent likes because it's his birthday and I feel like he's one I don't usually befriend very often, so I could give him the tea. Chocolate cake. <laughs> Let's see. Probably. Uh, cranberry candy, ginger ale, grapes, pink cake, and snails. <laughs> this kid likes snails. Cool. Let's see what I can do. What are the things he likes? Cranberry candy. We don't have. Ginger ale. Don't got. Grapes. No. Pink. Oh, we got grapes. We got grapes. Pink cake and snails. So grapes. Well, that's a blackberry. Grapes. We, we can give him a gold star grape if you want. Yeah. And then give him the tea. And then give him the tea. Just dose that kid with tea. <laughs> 95 hours in and you got this, Wait, Brandon. I forgot to put this in the shipping bin. Okay. Do you have any grapes? <gasps> What's happening? Oh. Do we get a meat? I hear something. What? Oh! Oh no, the tree's falling over! <gasps> oh! Sorry, that was loud. I heard it echo. I'm so sorry. Oh, I like, like, like that uh, farming one. 9993. <laughs> Lost opportunity. Look at that honey money. It probably wasn't, it was probably the strawberries, but heck yeah. Bunnies. I wanna go see. I wanna go Wait, see. News. What? Weather report. No, I wanna go see. I'll look later. Oh. Come. We must go. We have places to be, things to do. Wait. Okay. Are you using the, the obelisk or no? Oh. Sure. <laughs> I was gonna run. <gasps> oh. 
What is? Uh, the old tree is gone. However, with 100 pieces of hardwood, this could be fixed up. I can fix it. I can fix it. I can Don, fix it. Wait, wait. I got it. I got it. Give me a second. Mike has it. Mike has it. Uh. Oh, raccoon house. Raccoon. Let me in. 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 You can't go in. There is no in. Uh, uh, okay. Well, it's okay. It's okay. We've, we've built it now. It is a Moogle house. <laughs> if you build it, they shall come. Oh. I want raccoon friend. I want raccoon friend. I was hoping to get a cutscene. <laughs> I'll wait. I'll wait however long it takes, so game. it's Wednesday. I am very happy. <gasps> yeah, the treehouse and a wonderful life, too. By the way, I'm fishing all these herrings out. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, which move goes on this farm? I am uh, gonna go check weather and stuff because now I've seen that. The uh, food for today is just baked fish. Okay. Okay, herring. The pond is empty. Oh, we have one, one blue jazz honey. Some. I was gonna leave that because it's not in tune with well, the others. Too late. It's oh. been picked. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Does that make raccoons elves in this game? I'm okay with this. Who? Does that make raccoons elves? Oh, they said owls. So that's why I said <laughs> I'm sorry, Rosie. I wasn't ignoring you. It was just there was a lot happening. Fix up the giants. Oh. Also, you were talking. Oh, I think the quest is glitch. It's saying I haven't fixed it. But I saw you fix it. So. I don't have that quest. I think you had it, but then you fixed it. So you didn't oh. know about it. Oh, it's all good. It's all good. Uh, or or so I never had it because it was... The host's quest. Um, it, you know what? It, you might it might get fixed by tomorrow. Okay, we'll see. Right, because it because everything takes a day. Yeah. I just got farming up to level nine, I think. Yeah, we have four chickens. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna bring the tea and the grapes to. Oh a... wait. Or was that the gust? Gus eggs are done, okay. I'm gonna go give Gus all the eggs. Okay. If I can, I'm gonna avoid putting the duck egg in. Yeah, no worries, I got you. Um, but we'll see. Don't forget to look for, uh, leaks. Yes, I'm going to keep an eye out. I'll just be wandering around all day, I think, today. Because you said you were mining. Um, well, first I'm getting the eggs in. But... Yeah. Vincent? Fuck, it's closed till noon. Oh, well, it's okay. Officially made it to over 400k points. Nice. Where the heck is Vincent hanging out? Is he going to He's hang going out towards Penny? the... You're right behind him. Yeah. Hi. I don't know how old you're turning, and I don't know why you don't age year after year, but we're not going to ask questions. There we go. Is it a birthday present? Can I open it now? Oh, well, this is exactly what I wanted. There we go. Networking. Nice. You're friends with people. So... Yeah, pretty much a couple more gifts, and he is, like, done. We can buy butterfly powder. Hmm. Oh, no. Don't buy butterfly. Butterfly powder is the bad one. Oh, okay. It's the one that you sprinkle on your animals. I don't know what this is, but okay. What, butterfly powder? You get rid of them? Yeah, it sprinkles to get rid of them. We talked about this last time. Oh. If you made a mistake on your pet you chose, and it's irreversible. Right, okay. You gonna get some food, Rosie? I hope you enjoy. What are you getting? Can I have some? Yeah, we don't know what we're doing for... What uh, is it? For food tonight, either, Brandon. What is everybody else eating? Or yeah. have eaten? It's a food time for me. We had 
wraps for breakfast. Which were delicious. Turkey wraps, a little bit of lettuce, some red onion, some ranch, seasoning, sauce, and uh, shredded cheese in a tortilla. And then like fried, not fried. Um, just put on a skillet, heat it up on a skillet. No oil or anything, just heat it up pretty much. We had roast lamb for dinner here. Oh, nice. Two fried eggs with runny oats, two slices of butter toast, three strips of crispy bacon. Okay. Sounds like you went to a restaurant. I want the butter to toast really bad. <laughs> that out of everything there, I want the toast. Ordered some noodles and mini spring rolls earlier. Oh. Eight, noodles 12, sounds good. Four, eight, twelve. He needed 24. For. Gus? Yeah, 24, 24. I was just checking. Home though, not at a restaurant. Done. Nice. Good job, man. And that means we should have a ticket on the board. We had one for this week already. Uh, no. We have a ticket on the billboard. Oh, a ticket. Sorry. Go grab that. Mike's tired of me. He's like, why? <laughs> Are you on your way down there right now? Yes, I am. Okay. Um, I want to meet you halfway so I can give you the ticket. I'm passing by the mines right now, so. Perfect. I'm going to head up to Robin's right now. Oh, wait, Robin's. I can move her the nice. thingy. So I'll, I'll wait outside here. Hi. Thank you. See if it'll let me do this. So, for anybody who's just popped in, and doesn't know what I just did. If you get those prize tickets uh, in multiplayer, like, and this is how broken this could be. If you have like eight multiplayer people and you finish one of those, every single person gets one. So, I just hand them to Crystal, and we just fly through hers. Yeah. Um, it doesn't seem like the prizes are randomized, at least from what we noticed. So we just decided to put it all into mind and get some of the good quality stuff quickly. Yeah. Greenhouse has been moved. I hope everything okay inside is okay. I guess we'll see. I think it'll be fine, but... I can't imagine they would do that to us. Can anyone tell me quickly, is there uh, anything I need on my fishing bait to fish a lava eel out? Or can I just fish and it's just low chances? Off the top of my head, I don't think you do. I think you're just going to catch a lot of garbage there, but... Which I don't mind, because I can just put in our recyclers. Just... Okay, never mind. I got... <laughs> you found it. Yeah, normal fishing. Good to know. So if I get everyone else... Uh, max rank before this. Hope the next game we don't have to raise someone's social life. Max for a true good ending. It's annoying. Uh, yeah, I Love feel like you. I can see why. You got it? Yeah, I'm gonna try for another. Like, I, I can see why they did it that way, but also, yeah, it is a bit uh, grindy in a way. Oh, hello, Iris. How are you today? How was your was... Stardew stream? Were you playing Stardew today? Mm -hmm. Does it say it up there? They were. They were. Okay. I hope you had an amazing stream. Welcome on in, friends. If y'all are new, my name is Crystal. I'm playing... <laughs> Quack. I'm playing the 1.6 update with my partner, Mike. Uh, and we've just been kind of enjoying our second spring in, uh, in the update. Welcome on in. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. We were creeping on your stream, like... Pretty much every day you were streaming this last couple of days we've been in there <laughs> lurking. Um, you you taught us where a certain golden trash can is, so thank you for that. Uh, yeah, welcome on in, Raiders, if y'all are new uh, hmm. to the stream. Question of the day for today. Um, what is the oldest game that you will still pick up and play? Just casually. So, for example, My Small Fantasy VII, which came out in 1997. Or OG Pokemon. One or the other. Love the veil on the horse. Thank you. People were saying it looks kind of like Sephiroth, and I agree. 
Uh, okay, we got baguette. Should we get more mayonnaise makers now that we're gonna be getting four eggs a day? Yeah, I usually try to keep as many. And then every other day we'll be getting like five eggs a day? Yeah, yeah. Super Mario World or Pitfall, yeah. Absolutely. And... Bear with, I think I missed... I missed someone else's answer. I thought I did. See you with Simpsons it and run though, Brandon. Oh, uh, okay, so we got more bombs. And also, raiders, if y'all need to raid and run after stream, take care of yourself, feel more than free. But if you'd like to hang out with us, that's cool too. I can't remember, did you look around the forest for forging already? I looked around the top part. I'll look around the bottom if you I'm want. I'm going already. Okay, I thought you were going to mine today, so. I wanted to fish that lava eel. That was my primary thing. Okay, used I'm, to I'm going to go into the mines then. <laughs> used to have my energy to do so. <laughs> yeah. I have to find some food, but I'll be lurking. Thank you so much for the lurk. I hope you enjoy your food. We were actually just discussing what we're potentially going to have for food tonight. And or what Chad is eating. I thought we decided that already. Did we? Yeah, I thought it was a salad and chicken. <gasps> All right, we're going to go out. Yeah, that works. Well, like, unless you don't want that, then we can do something else. But No, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. I just forgot. Uh, all right, back to floor 40. I'm trying to get more iron. I forgot to check the crops if they're done. No, they're not. Okay, good. I'm getting a lot of iron in here today so far, that's so that's nice. really nice. brother isn't responding. It's been four or five minutes past our Baldur's Gate 3 session start time. Oh no! Hopefully he's okay. Hopefully he gets back to you soon. How likely knowing your brother would it be that he just took a nap or something? Yeah, probably just asleep. Yeah. <laughs> just assuming that might be the case. breakfast burritos for dinner. I just made a healthy pizza alternative for lunch. Oh, nice! What did you have on your pizza? I do love me a good breakfast burrito. Actually, like, breakfast for dinner in general. Top tier. That sounds good. <laughs> do you want that instead? I don't know. That's a, that's a lot more work. See, like, I was kind of considering we could do the pasta chicken, but, like, split the chicken between some gnocchi because we need to finish it up. Have the, pa have the salad on the side, and then some chicken in both. That's a lot of food. It is a lot, That's but we do much. need to finish it. So the, we can do the chicken and gnocchi, but I wouldn't... We'd be using less chicken. Mm-hmm. Um, it would add extra food to that. I would like that, actually. Chicken and gnocchi with the ch spicy sauce? Yeah, sure. Okay. So no salad. I might argue with the salad just because veggies or I could like cook up some of those frozen veggies and like throw it all in. I we finished that. Oh we did. I want to buy more then. I like those. <laughs> Finding actually easy to cook frozen veggies. Oh more iron. That are within budget? Yes. <laughs> Dear lord is trying to be healthy expensive. I almost feel like what I heard um, was it Aldi's you know, idea of how they do business where they only have one thing of everything to make things cheaper. Mm, so I, no. wish, I wish our government would just do that. It's like, yeah, we're only allowing one brand of peanut butter in this country. I feel like, though, then there's no competition. There isn't. To drive down any price. Like, they're just going yeah, to charge what they want. No, no, then, then it would just be purely regulated. Mm. Right? So peanut butter can never go over this cost. Mm-hmm. 
toilet paper can never go over this cost. Things can never go over X cost. So yeah. obviously everything would sit at the maximum. And then you'd have discount stores that would drop it lower than the maximum. Mm -hmm. Right? That's what it would be. But it would be like such heavy regulation. It would be ridiculous. Uh, turkey pepperoni. Oh, I'd love turkey pepperoni cheese. And yeah. eggs like an omelet. We'll turkey see. Turkey shell. Nice. Inflation should, but if everything, if if legitimately everything was regulated correct, like properly, where no one was getting the upper hand over the next person, mind you, that would be utopia, which is impossible, uh, because we're humans. Um, there would be no inflation, because nothing would become more tedious to do, because you're still just doing the same job, right? But then you need heavy, heavy population control. So, because we only can have X amount of mouths to feed. <laughs> Love some frozen broccoli. Yeah. Got the half the past few days. Two to go. Nice, Rebecca. I'm glad. Glad that they've been uh, being nice to you. Welcome on in from that read as well, by the way. So, we just had to give... <sighs> Seven more leaks. We have so many days to finish it, so, like, we're good. Uh, oh, we have lots of iron in here. Good. Good, good, good. I should probably be working on coal then instead. Or gold. Gold, not coal, sorry. Our first duck mayonnaise. Uh, silver problem, yeah. Yeah, Should I drink it? Don't drink it. <laughs> Gross. But it's duck mayonnaise. It's not regular mayonnaise, okay? Does not make it any better. It is actually better. Seen online, like, the ultimate power move. Empty out a thing of mayonnaise. Fill it with, like, vanilla pudding. Go around eating it with a spoon in front oh, of yeah. people. Oh, yeah. Do it. <laughs> And then the ultimate, ultimate power move. Swap out that person's jar of vanilla for actual mayonnaise. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Drinking blue Gatorade of an empty Windex uh, bottle. Good morning, dear. Evelyn, why are you here? Holy well, walk out here. I haven't seen this old farm in a long time. It seemed better than I remembered. Okay, Evelyn, what do you want? Oh, Mike's already reading it, so... I brought you a little something. It's a gift from Garner to another. What is this? Oh, yes! Ha -ha. Garden pot? Yes. Yeah, I know you like those. You can do tea in those if you'd like. I can do coffee in those if you I like. You can do coffee, true. You just gotta water it. I'll put mine in the tool chest for okay. you. Okay, that's all I wanted to know. You can go now. Bye-bye. I didn't finish that story with her. <gasps> Come on. And we got... Spots are really handy. You can use them to grow crops in any season indoors. They also look nice outside, but out here they can only house in-season crops. Need more. They're really easy to make, too. Here I've got an old magazine clipping with instructions. You can't see what I'm doing right now. I can see you standing on the deck next to me. Oh, you got a fridge. Yep. Is that from... Gus. Oh. His quest gave us an additional fridge. Oh, there we go. The yolks look amazing. I think this will be my best omelet yet. I think you also get a cutscene, I believe. I remember seeing a massive omelet. I'm putting it at the bottom. There you go. We have three fridges now, guys. And I think we can craft them too, can't we? Uh, I don't remember. Oh, no, we don't have the recipe for it. Oh, man. That would have been funny, just a whole room full of fridges. Um, so potatoes aren't ready, those aren't ready, nothing's ready today. So, I guess I'm gonna go get- you said you're gonna get gold? Yeah, unless you wanna go get it, I'm, I'm indifferent. Um, actually I'm gonna go check out the foraging. I gotta do the animals first. I'm gonna go check on the greenhouse, and if it's empty I will cry. We're good. We're good. No crying today. Why would it be empty? I moved oh, it and I was scared. It. You never, ever, ever know. Did I hug all the chickens? Nope. 
Where it? Uh, one chicken escaped outside before I hugged it. <laughs> and now just chickens like freedom. I do like the fact that we're over 100k again. Yeah, we've been making money like no tomorrow. It's all good. Spent a lot that one day, but it was it was worth it. I cannot believe I'm still at <laughs> level nine four J. Please send help. All right, here goes the final boss. The first half. I'm so anxious. You got this. Just picturing Mike diving and just landing on his face as the chicken darts out the door. Oh, <gasps> raccoon! Sorry, there's a lot of energy. I'll tone it down. You forgot it. Oh. Let me love you. Let me love you. Raccoon hungry. Need fish. I will. Fi oh, he um, wants cat cockles. We we have those. And smoked greens. So we don't have the smoker yet. I'm gonna go buy the smoke. Okay. Well, it's just a recipe. I will feed him. He will be fed. Actually, I'll go get the recipe now. You're gonna go get it? Yeah, it takes me two seconds to get there. Okay. Oh, the Do power have... of teleporting. Do we have the, 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 the... I guess I'll wait till we get the smoke frame. Do the we have the, the cockles? Yes, it's in the fishing bin. Okay. Um... Oh good, Willie just got back in his shop. And go behind the counter, please. Thank you. Smoker. <laughs> Finally. We do so much fishing and we just have not bothered. Oh right, I forgot we did the thing for Willie, so now we can buy large fish tanks. Mm-hmm. Not that we need it, but... I mean, it's kind of nice to have. It is. But it's better when you have that extra room for it. Silver pot. <laughs> eh. Okay. Um. No leaks. Oh, oh, jeez. That was a snake attack. I didn't even see him there. And again, for anyone who might be new, who has not heard, Mike and I went to the zoo. Our zoo here has a lot of fantastic, wonderful animals from all over the world. And we spent the most time in that zoo outside the raccoon enclosure, which literally looked as if they had made this pit. And they had just waited for a raccoon to climb in and then dug up the walls around it. Like well, that, That's what the old one was. And this year, or this past year that we it. went. They made a better one, yeah. They kicked the raccoons out of that one and they put them in a proper cage. But yeah, we spent the most. Um, I got a trash can catalog. The trash can lid literally blew off the garbage can. Yeah, you got the lid. No, I got the catalog. Oh. Access a free supply of trash decorations. Wash hands after use. Interesting. Trash can catalog. It literally, if you go outside of Ken's house, the, the garbage can has zero lid on it now because the lid, it literally went, It gets bang. blown off, yeah. Yeah, I see that. Did you give the, the cockles? Uh, let me check. Because I don't know if we have five. We have three. Oh. So we need to put in more fish bait. Yeah, crab bins. Um, do you want me to do that? Sure. I'm up here going to put down this trash can catalog somewhere. Where should I put it? Uh, in the house somewhere. Okay. It says that. I can put it outside, too. Time to fill your house with trash furniture. You know it. We're going to live our best trash panda lives. Plastic lawn chair, moldy couch, broken television, buried tire, a plastic bag... Oh, that aluminum sounds cans, awesome. bottles, it's just garbage. And garbage wallpaper, too. Oh, fill our house, please. That sounds like a good time. But I don't want to get rid of our mystery wallpaper, so... You don't have to get rid of that, just put it in the bedroom. I put a different trash one in the bedroom. But yeah. It's a, it's, it's epic, huh? Clint wants a bream. I don't know if we have one. Uh, have? In order to make the smoked one. Where do you catch breams? Uh, river? River, 6 p.m. to 2 a.m. 
All seasons, any time. Oh, easy. No, wait, sorry. All seasons, any weather. Okay, did you make the smoker? No. <laughs> I... Did we both get the recipe if you've bought it? Yeah. Because we bought it. What does it look like? I got it. I made it. I don't see anything that looks oh. like it. Okay, never mind. Then I guess we don't. It would have been up the top. Yeah, I didn't I didn't think we both would get it. Well, I made it. That sucks. I didn't know that only I got it. Yeah. That's ten K for me. It's okay. Now you have it, you're just gonna be in charge of making any of them. I made one. I'm gonna fish in the river. Wait, which other ones have I bought? God, can I not buy any craftable things then? No, you can buy any of them. I just have to buy them later, that's all. Doesn't matter. My brother has awoken from his slumber. Yes, enjoy your boulder skate. Shiva, I absolutely love that emote. <laughs> I hope you're having a good one. Well, I guess it's early. It's 6 p.m. for this. Hey, Max. I hope you've been enjoying your lurk. Oh, you know what? Actually, just because I, I don't really need to be fishing here yet. Please respawn. Our wine is complete. We can move it into your house then? Sure. Are you gonna do it? Or do you want me to come back and do it? I can do it. Okay. It means I gotta reorganize my house a bit too. Ooh, I got an artifact trove from the uh, panning. Just seeing all the godly riches to play right now. You're watched. Are you playing Overwatch ranked? Oh dear. <laughs> Have fun. I got a rusty spoon. No, sorry, that's a prehistoric tool. Wrong one. Not a rusty spoon. Disappointed. My friend also got the PS5 for Boulder's Gate. over here okay um i guess i'll just continue searching around we have like three hours to kill two and a half i guess uh and we need more leaks i don't know what you want to put in these kegs, but I put them all. I put one outside and then put the rest inside. Um, there's cranberries in the fall bin. Mm -hmm. That's what I was just filling it with right now. Okay. Uh, Kim and I can start game Baldur's Gate because we heard you can romance people and there's and a multiplayer option. Sell it? Yeah. Um, but then we realized the romance alone probably isn't the best reason to get it. I mean, you know what? If it, I would say if it goes on sale with those kind of goals in mind. Yeah, it is our hello. How are you today? Welcome on in. Ropey as heck. <laughs> it's a reason to get it. Yeah. I'll go to the uh, bathhouse area. I like how you still manage to put batteries inside the mining bin. <laughs> I don't, it's just habit. Just how I usually organize things. It's, it's different playing with you. And guaranteed. Um, for those who don't know, by the way, this is Mike's last stream with us for a couple days, at least. Um, 
he's going back to work. So you guys are going to be just with me playing Stardew from tomorrow to... Um, Tuesday? Tuesday. Tuesday. We're going to keep Wednesday for whatever Wednesday probably this week. Um, and then if Mike feels like it, he can come back on Saturday. Or he doesn't have to. You know? Doesn't have to. No pressure. Pokemon Sun Master. Thank you so very much for the five-month resub. Thank you. I guess you collected all the garbages. I think I did, yeah. Um, but yeah, so the place is going to be a little different. Be a little sad. Yeah, you won't have my, my retort. Yeah, I know. It's just me thinking that I know things when I don't. Nothing else. Wait, no. Back in sold. So wait, uh, someone... Let's go try to get the fish. Who wants the smoked bream? The raccoon. Oh. And five cockles. Oh, and five cockles. Yeah, so that's why I, I got was... a bream. Oh, you got a bream already? Yeah, it's after six o'clock. Okay. <laughs> I was just going to go start fishing. I feel like I've not been doing anything today. I haven't been doing anything. I've been stuck on the farm all day. <laughs> I've been running around and not finding any leaks. Because I collected them already. <laughs> Apparently you were on the farm, though. Ravenclaw has, thank you so much for the 10 months of resub. I appreciate that. My day starts off with hugging chickens and cows. Then I run south and I go into the forest, do a lap. And then I go and I try to hit the beach and see if there's any forageables on the beach. Truly, that the fact that I didn't have the horse is just ridiculous. But okay, I got us two breams just in case. Thanks. Do you still have that quest for fixing the stump? Uh, bear with me for a second. And Lee, thank you so much for the twenty-three month resub. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Hope you've been doing good. And uh, welcome back. Probably please. It's between Super Mario Bros. Three and Sailor Moon. Another story. Um, Fossil Fighters game. My to start. Yeah. So, bear with me here. What am I doing again? Do you have the quest for the stump still? I do. Okay. So I think I shouldn't have let you do that. Okay. Oh, wait, I need a bream for Clint as well, apparently, so I'm going to go get that. I have two. Oh, okay. Did you feel the bins at the beach? Yeah. Okay. There we go. Hype train, <laughs> scam train, whichever way you want to say it. Bream is cooking. Oh, you wanted another bream? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Clint, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh! Oh, here's the giant omelette. That's scene. Well, folks, once again, we're gathered for a very special occasion. A rare visit from my very dear friend. My world-famous giant omelette. Zesty bell pepper, juicy tomato, rich mushroom, and tangy cheese all enrobed in a blanket of rich, fluffy egg. Dig in, folks. That thing is the size of a table. Do you get anything for that cutscene? I don't know. Billy, what do you think? Mushrooms are a tad chewier than last year. Is that a good thing? It's great, Gus, and it tastes even better because it's all in the house. <laughs> Mike just wandered in. <laughs> These eggs are so rich and yellow. Marnie, are these from your place? You can thank Crystal over at Tater Farm. Not Mike, though. 
Not Mike. As <laughs> he leaves. Hmm, tater eggs. Wait. Wait. You heard her right. Tater does not like eggs. Tater eggs. Uh. There we go. So who want the bream? The Oh, uh the the non cooked one? Clint, okay, thank you. Clint, yeah. Yeah, I'd pass on the mushroom too with that, but everything else sounded good. You say the mushrooms? Mushrooms are great. Yeah. Eh, yeah. indifferent. Maybe it's just because I'm a fun guy. Oh, that's such an old joke. I love it. <sighs> you hate bell peppers, and my mom doesn't like them either. I love them. No, oh, I caught my bream. And I got a bone flute. That sounds wrong. I took out the smoke. <laughs> I took out the smoked um, bream. It's in the fishy chest with the three cockles that we own. Okay. There's a lot of innuendos here. But I got a bone flute. I fished it in the water. I bitch the collapse in half a year by rescuing the collapsed steel parts. I knew he was stupid, but even dumber than I thought. I don't know how deep that river is, but that just sounds like it's probably more effort than it is worth. Crazy footage from that, though. Hey, psst. Psst, yeah? Crystal. What, what, what? Do you want to see my bone flute? No, I don't. Mark. Get out. Go away. <laughs> Pervert, you flasher. Mark. Bro. Mark. <laughs> I'm sorry, just running a man. Back from peating, peating buffer, yep, no. Oh, don't forget to, to appreciate the wallpaper. Oh my god, we look like we live in a shack. The mystery shack. <laughs> Goes with the trailer next door. How's, uh, how's Bear doing affection? Lost the entire structural integrity. It's such an absurd proposal. Yeah, no, that does not sound safe. Uh, Rebecca, money. I'd argue. <laughs> but yeah, here's the catalog right here. Tomorrow's the egg festival. Do we want to go again, or are we going to leave it this year? We can get money. We can get money. But it all is a waste of an entire day. Yeah. Your, chi your blue chicken's blue now. <laughs> blue chicken. He's, he's a lot, like, he's a chicken chicken now. I was going to say, wasn't he already blue? Oh, look at him. Where the fuck the duck go? You know, you know the dangerous part about this water is. What? The duck might actually jump in it. The duck can go in the water. I've seen it like once. One, two, three, four, five. Silver five. Bomb, thank you for the clip. I will be doing a stream moments clip. I'm probably gonna work on that tomorrow. Um, there's gonna be a lot of shenanigans because it's not only March; it's gonna be February as well. I'm scared. <laughs> Wait, actually, I need to bring bait with me, not that. Uh, because we need to go see if we can't get any more of those thingies. Tomorrow's the Egg Festival IRL too, right? I guess so, yeah. Weird. I don't know what it is with the sounds in multiplayer recently, but they have been very broken. So the first time Mike does an action on the farm, whether it's watering or milking, it sounds like he's doing it 50 times all at once. <laughs> it's like overlapping sound. Okay, food's not done yet. I love him. Like, look at his little, he does the little, like, the little hands. Yeah, but we got to go to the beach to see if... Uh, I'm, I'm going, I'm going right now. I have bait with me to refill as well. Did you do your morning foraging yet? No, I just left the farm. <laughs> I could be judging. Phase three, Brandon. Step on me, Clint. 
Oh, man. The amount of nonsense that's come out of my face over the last two months. I just got two Omni Geodes by panning. Oh, nice. Yeah. <gasps> we got one cockle. We need one more. I think those things can be refilled more than once a day, though. Aren't they? Or is um, it... I think it is only the one a day, but... That's when Isu was asking you to step on her. Okay, foraging run. I should probably just continue to give Vincent grapes too, because that's actually a really easy gift that I didn't realize he liked. <laughs> oh, traveling lady today. Uh... Cheese patchwork. Nothing interesting. Okay. I've actually forgotten a lot about this game, but I swear those great things weren't called cockles. I don't think I've ever really paid attention to what they were called. Um, but now I definitely am. I honestly hate that the last little tick for forging takes forever. It really does. It doesn't help that I've also been avoiding chopping like our normal trees around the valley because I have a suspicion Robin might be like, hey, 1,000 normal wood, please. So, if, oh, there's a smoke cream. I'm going to give him the smoke cream now. Can we give both? It's a bundle, hon. Okay. Is it actually in our bundles? No, the bullet board's the last thing in there. That's funny. Yeah, so it's not listed there. You know, it's funny, I had the the cutscene with uh, the woman in the desert, but I didn't actually talk to her. No. no so you so, still don't know who she is? She's still got question marks in my... Yeah. And I just looked it up. The uh, You can only get the crap hot things once a day. Yeah, okay. I thought so. I figured as much as just... You never know. It is Stardew. Does blue chicken mayo look different? Not as of the last update, as far as I remember, but it might now. I doubt it, but okay. you never know. And Clint wanted a bream. So much garbage I gotta run around with these days. <laughs> or something I'm lazy. You run a little bit faster than me. It would be cool if it was blue, I agree like blue egg well if you look at the egg and you hover over it it says regular brown chicken egg regular white white chicken egg mm. right so if you were like very 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 limited on space for whatever reason then you would only want one of each um animal or you'd want only one kind of chicken Oh, yeah, daylight savings tonight for our European <coughs> friends. Good reminder, Rebecca. What a pointless thing these days. Um, I hope that, you know, everyone doesn't get too thrown off by it. I know we were pretty thrown off. And, uh, I guess stream tomorrow is going to be at a slightly different time. For you guys. For you. <laughs> In EST, we are going to be exactly the same. My dogs were not happy. Yeah, I know. If they're used to going out at a certain time, Ollie also got pretty thrown off. Or he was just being Ollie. We don't know. Yeah. You know, he, he can be an Ollie sometimes. We were uh, clipping his claws the other day, which he's actually very, very good for, especially compared to, like, Kiara. Um, he's perfect, really. Um, but he has his bad paw, he has the bad leg that he's very sensitive about, so he doesn't like you touching it. But of course you need to. Um, and what we've kind of worked out 
is the best way to do it is for me to hold him on my lap with his little feet sticking out so he's sitting up like a little people and uh <laughs> sorry the duck always quacks at the best times um uh, like we'll actually do the the clipping itself um so all is perfectly fine for his little back toe beans no issue you can touch those doesn't care uh really good uh, for his, uh, actually, I'm gonna go mining today. Uh, really good for his other three, for his bottom paws and his top paw. It's the bad paw that's bad. And, um, uh, what he'll do when he, he, he doesn't bite, he doesn't hiss, he doesn't really wiggle too, too much. He might a little bit, he might squirm. Um, but what he does when he's scared and he doesn't want to acknowledge that something is happening is he'll try to hide his head in like my hand or my arm to get away from the situation. <laughs> and it's the cutest thing. He did it at the vets when I last took him in too. He's like, I just, I just don't want to be here. <laughs> Not looking forward to losing an hour with Bear. He's trying to get, he's going to try to get you up at 4 a.m. Bear, why? Don't do that. Enjoy the sleep. Secret note. I'm following one right now. Uh, that's gifting things. I did my cat Missy, but she hated it when I did. She tried try to take the nail clippers. <laughs> no, all these actually surprisingly very, very good for nail clipping. Wait, we gained an hour? <laughs> Affection's like, actually, this isn't so bad. Yeah, you're good. You've already done the hard part. A couple months ago with Bear. This one. Um, we need bunnies. Mm -hmm, that's gonna be the final coop upgrade, I guess. I'm trying to figure out where I just heard a really weird sound from. I don't think it was in game. Hopefully, that was just through my headset. Oh no, maybe it is just ambient noise. Okay, never mind. Penny's handwriting, gifts for her mom. Hi, Andrew, how are you today? Bruh. Clint, I need to know where you are. Forgot to give you your bream. on this floor. Blake, thank you so much for hanging out. Have a good one. We'll see you next time. Actually, um, speaking of time change, this is very, very minimal. Uh, we were watching the news the other day and apparently... I don't know what they're called, if they're like just officially just called timekeepers or whatever. Um, but there are people who keep track of like the Earth's rotations and like if our times and our clocks are on track and stuff. 
Um, and apparently they're concerned that by 2026, we might have to actually do a negative second. So we need to lose a second to keep everything the way it should be, apparently. Um, and they're a bit concerned because it's like, can can everything even do that? So, yes, it can. We don't have to fear it. It's not going to crash everything. It's the not, markets will it's be fine. Why 2 k It's not going to be a problem. <laughs> All, like, you know, you know what the hardest issue is going to be? Hmm. Just getting the goddamn programmers to get off their ass and just program it. That's True. it. True. Blautista, hello. How was your stream today? What were you all up to? It's like your your cell phone connects to the internet and updates itself all the time. You don't even recognize it updating. Right? Mm -hmm. For all you know, it could have changed your time like three times already. Oh, no, second, it could. Definitely. Right? Your computer's time, regulated by the internet also. Mm -hmm. Smartwatch, regulated by the internet. Everything is regulated by the internet. So all that I got to do is push that code. Done. That's it. It was just an interesting. Uh, it's called fear mongering. No, no, I don't think they were trying to make people scared. It was just interesting to learn about. <laughs> Mike gets angry at the news. I can't I, put it on without him getting angry. I think if you're gonna spew news like that, you gotta give the proper details. Don't just give sensation over sensationalized nonsense. Oh, absolutely. No, definitely. Just in terms of time. Plenty of time to prepare, right? Platisa, starting's going good. We've been progressing through our first, no, second spring, second year. Uh, we got our greenhouse set up today. Uh, we've been doing good. We met uh, a new little character. Fluting and bullet journal coloring. Oh, cool. Switch mobile main derived. several times in the past oh cool i didn't know it's very interesting wait new character yes i'm avoiding saying anything just in case people in here don't want to know but i assume you're fine if you're watching a stardew stream but yeah there's a little friend down by marnie's who we met Um, event day? Are we going or no? We can. You don't sound like you want to. We don't have to. It's just there's no benefit to us. I feel like we usually earn more money outside of event anyway. Yeah, I guess we could always just go to the mines. Um, uh, rainbow shell from Demetrius. I love because you have your menu open. Every time I touched a strawberry, it was pausing. Oh, yeah. Like just now. Mm -hmm. By the way, I'm level 9 farming now. Good job. How come, Rebecca, with that one? Too many places still use 32 bit. Oh, okay. I think I understand the idea. Got you. Derived, I actually finished Fable for the first time last year. Maybe it was the year before. It was a lot of fun, though. I enjoyed Fable a lot. So I hope you like it, too. For the first time? Oh my goodness, really. How did you enjoy? I am going to harvest honey, I guess. And then I'm going to go check on... Uh, our traps. Yep. Couldn't I find just, Haley. I just realized that we're, we have to... If we want to, we, we should smoke every fish we get from now on to get maximum money out of it. Yep. But it takes forever. Oh, wait. I can't actually go do the traps, did I? Why? Because they're on the beach. Use a teleporter. Okay. It is on Steam, actually. Yeah, that's where I Where's played. Where's our second cow? Oh, there it is. Put your bone flute away, huh? Shh. 
Yeah, and Xbox Game Pass. That's actually one of the reasons why we have Xbox Game Pass. Um, like, the, the full one, not just for PC. Uh, because then we can play on console as well, and it's really nice. And I had brought over my Xbox One. One day I'd actually like to stream Fable as well. It was it was a very fun playthrough. Uh, okay, so blue chicken is literally just two white eggs. Yeah, I think so. So I don't know about you, if you want to harvest more hay, you can. I can, and I, we got our last cockle. Nice. Oh, how are you gonna get back here? I brought a. Uh, you got two. Okay. Imagine I was if smart. you if you didn't. We just go into the festival, <laughs> or I'd pass out on the beach. No, I just teleport to you and then give you one. We'd be wasting it, but it's okay. Okay, I'm gonna go bring these to little cutie. Where did the bream go? I gave it already. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, don't make me panic. <laughs> You're the one making you panic. I'm making some potato wine. Uh, max value in 2038, we'll roll over and think we're back in 1901, which is obviously a problem. Yeah, no kidding. Hi. Need fish? I got... Oh, shit. What? Look at how big this farm field is and we have no seeds. Farm field? I just har harvested all the potatoes. Oh, it's okay. We'll, go, we'll get it tomorrow. It's all good. It's fine. Thanks, Bobo. Take this. I got 25 carrot seeds. That's it? Seed carrot seeds. Now, maybe I find a wife. Yes. I will find you a wife. I want baby raccoons. <laughs> I think we just teleported at the same time. Maybe. Yeah, he just says something to me. <laughs> Did you do a lap around the forest or no? Not yet. I'm doing it now. I'll go and take the upper half then. Alright. We need seven more. Still 14 years and more and more systems are using 64 bit timestamps instead now. Sorry for the hiccups. Uh, but a lot of systems definitely won't be updated at a time. So sorry for the poor IT people working around in some of those like companies and stuff who are going to get blamed. <laughs> Or told to do it like really quickly and get it all done and sorted. I just feel sorry for uh, the one day that we actually transitioned 100% to uh, was it IPv version 6, which is uh, IP addresses. They're gonna gonna be that that little tiny code. It's gonna be like 16 characters long, and apparently we're gonna have enough codes that. We'll have enough to give IP addresses to everybody on the planet, 100 times over, and the moon. Like, Jeez. Like, it's just, we're going to have too many. Apparently, we already use it. Well, we do have it, but when we fully implement it and no one, like, we, we get rid of the archaic ones. Mm-hmm. So, pretty much transition everybody's over to that, and then all systems only use that from now on. It would make any older consoles that use Wi-Fi obsolete. Oh. Because they, they wouldn't be able to understand the code. Mm. Your lights are flickering. Yeah, they are. It doesn't show up on camera, at least. But yeah, that's probably dying. It's older. That hurt my brain. Sorry. We'll never get rid of the old ones because of internal addresses. Yeah. Because the Macs, you can't really change those. Say la vie. This 
lava eel is not very productive. I think I remember, I think I had them on my old save and yeah, it takes a while. <laughs> Rosie, I hope the cleaning went well. You picked the farm with monsters? It's okay. I picked it last time for my on-stream farm, actually. I prefer the bigger, more open farms. Not gonna yell at you. Who's yelling at you about that, by the way? Oh, nice, huh? I am gonna make 40 of the wild seeds, the spring seeds, because, come on, potatoes aren't gonna earn us that much money. Yeah. And... We can get my forging and your forging up doing this. Okay, why not? And I used a bunch of the old ones from the bin, not our new ones that we've been collecting. Yeah. I leveled up combat. Okay, that only put a small dent in how much we have, so... Um, I mean, of the plots. That's okay. Here we go. Oh, I sir, he's like sliding around down here. I like how there's an egg festival going on and Pam's like, I'm drunk in front of the bus. Come take a ride. Fear. Six out of twelve leaks. And I just... Actually, I put very little, actually, in that area. I just want to fight creatures. Uh, it has begun. The forest is growing in the desert. I am very concerned that we're going to lose that. With the event. I know. But at least we have the other one. Uh, okay, I can go get that one right now, actually. Let's see here. Oh, that one? Mm-hmm. Oh, wait. I cannot go get it right now. Hmm? I keep forgetting about the event. Oh, that's funny. If you overproduce spring seeds... You can come here and sell two spring seeds. To the, um, the sorry, guy? two summer seeds for a spring seed, two winter seeds for a summer seed, and two spring seeds for a winter seed. That's cool. Oh my god, they're going right for the exit. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I thought they charged for the exit, and I'm like, excuse me. Um, odd question. I know pearls are worth 5,000 each, but can I trade a pearl? Trade one? Sure. Uh, the exotic goods, if I give one pearl, we can get a birch double bed. Yeah, why not? Oh, excellent accent. Here we go, I got the birch double bed. <clears throat> I'm gonna check out the skull caverns a little bit. Okay, do we need the squid ink? Oh no, I think I got that from a spawn in the caves. The mood though outside is terrifying. Hi Blue, how are you today? Welcome on in. Have you been lurking? Thank you so much for the lurk. Okay. Every now and then I just gotta pop my head in there and be like, hey, everything good? Who's outside? Do I know her? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start uh, laying out some more paths and organizing this farm a bit better.
forward to next month new bluey episodes one of them's gonna be 28 minutes how long are they normally are they like shorter oh that's a dumb mistake oh i'm not sure if anybody knows this but in the skull caverns there's those bugs that fly back and forth and you can't kill them right but you can stop them from moving if you go right up to them and you block just as they hit you, I think it counts as a brick wall and they stop going towards you. Hmm. And just kind of get stuck. There's not really a point of doing it, but... Uh, I'm in the Skull Caverns right now and I got an Iridium Bar. Nice. Uh, which setting is it that shows you how many of an item you can make? Um... I don't know if that's in the advanced crafting one or if that's just because I'm what? in... I can see how many I can make a lot of times. It might be that bot. It might be that it, the bench. So it might be the workbench, which is it access all of these three chests right here. Or I know that there is a weird setting I have. Show advanced crafting information. That might be what you're looking for. One or the other. Not sure which. I have both on always. And not sure if it's available for everywhere. Oh, that's been there for a while. I remember, like, in the other versions of the game as well. So, At the very least. So, Star Drop Saloon Special Orders. Mayor Lewis, Autumn Bounty. Marnie, Pumpkin Pie. Demetrius, Bean Hot Pot. Caroline, Fish Taco. That's gross. That's weird <laughs> to say that about someone. <laughs> Try that. Let me know. Let me know. Hopefully, uh, one of them is able to help you out there. It is very handy. Seven minutes. Oh, they're like shorter episodes then. I didn't know that. Isn't when you say bluey? Bluey. The dog? Yeah, that like uh cartoon show. Yeah. It's funny because those things didn't exist when I was a kid. I'm not talking about kid shows, I'm talking about Bluey the dog. <laughs> that would be kind of Sad. I cannot wait till my combat level's maxed out. These freaking eels hurt. They do, yeah. Phase five, final phase. You got this, Brandon. And I always feel bad because, like, I can get my health. My or just trying to get my health up supersedes my uh, energy. Like my energy is so high. It's like too high now. It's annoying. It's a parenting show that kids happen to enjoy. Yeah. No, I've, I've definitely heard that. Okay, there we go. So, a little bit more paths. Making it a little bit easier to navigate ourselves around here. Try to figure out exactly where I want the uh, Shit. animals to go. Okay, I gotta get out of here. That one button hit to navigate to that uh, auto sort button is like life changing. I am still I'm in awe. Pretty sure on the keyboard, it's literally is one button to auto sort. See, that's the thing. I knew that there must be a button on keyboard, but I was like, okay, I don't know about controller. Sometimes it doesn't translate well. Um, oh, but yeah. yeah, that's been there for a while, and I did not know. You're in bed already. I am. So we can't put the bed into bed. It's okay. We'll do it after. Oh, I can move. I'm out. Oh, but Ollie's in bed. I don't know if you can move an Ollie. It's okay. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I hate it when you accidentally pick up oh, a rug. I can't place beds in your house. You know what? Tomorrow. <laughs> can't have more than one bed. It, it, just, it would be weird. 
Level levels. nine farming. Seven combat. No farming doggo. No, we got a kitty cat. We might adopt another baby though. Wouldn't mind getting a pupper. The uh, the amount of honey you put in almost trumped money wise of the strawberries. Jeez. Yeah, the the honey is good. That's not even the full thing yet. Oh right. You beat him! There you go, Brandon. See? My god, the chickens just flew out of the... They were like, freedom! Alright, we learned how to make hash browns. It's a neutral day. It is Haley's birthday. If you have any strings from my favorite episodes in the main section Discord, absolutely. Feel free. Uh, tomorrow begins a three-day festival in Calico Desert. With the bus back in order, we're all delighted to be able to continue this time-honored beloved tradition. There will be games, free food, prizes, and much more. I... Six. I just saw what time it is, and I don't think we're going to get to this event. A today. new hick chicken has hatched. It looks odd. Oh, we got the white chicken. What's his name? Uh, default. You... Okay. Tr Trello? Name it default. Trello? Okay, sure. Why not? Gash? Um, also, two townspeople are selected each day to run a little shop, so make sure you swing by and check out what they have to offer. I'm going to tell you right now, the name of the void chicken was legitimately a random one that I was just smashing random on it, and I was like, yes. Hi. Yeah. I just pet Ollie, and he gave me a snail. Because he's at max friendship. Where did you find this? Why are you hunting snails? Why is that a very ollie thing to do? <laughs> Look at the little teeny boy chicken. <laughs> did you see his name? No, I haven't yet. That was legitimately auto-generated. Okay, bear with me. You can look it in your inventory. I don't want to talk to him. <laughs> I love some of the auto-generated names. I'm about to go to put a chest in here next to these makers because uh, we have too many eggs. Yeah, no worries. Also, where's my ollie command? I swear that was working earlier. I may have broken it. Oh yay, lava, lava eel row. I broke it. <laughs> it was legit working like two hours ago. Oh, oh, there we go. Cow move. Get to get yourself swiped. Oh, I should have used the golden station. So the raccoon still says he's trying to get a wife. Yeah, I still have the giant stump. I almost want to bring some hardwood over, but... I'm sorry I broke that. It's okay. I'm hoping it gets sorted. It's... I can get a red fez to join you. I suck. I mean, you could get it, but it's up to you. Nothing else in here is worthwhile. I feel so bad now. Like, I literally just ran over them like, wood! It's okay. We didn't know it was going to do that. Usually things are fine. Do a video in the background. You know how YouTube calculates how long haul. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, I died three ads and it calculated it wrong. There was 10 seconds missing from it. Ooh, awkward. And I still have the build a silo quest. Build a silo. Oh, right, yeah. Actually, you could make another one if you'd like. I could, but... Because I was planning on having, like, more than one. Okay, well, tell me where you need it. Just up by the greenhouse. Okay. There should be a little space there I think I left. Hopefully. And hopefully we got enough clay. So the best description of Crisis Core a few days ago, and I need to share it here. Please do. Crisis Core is just a normal guy being tormented by theater kids. <laughs> It is, it is. That is very accurate. 
I think the best thing about Crisis Core is Zach just going, what are you talking about? <laughs> he is like the one normal person in a sea of anime men. And it's great. Are you looking for leaks? Uh, yeah, I'm going north now. Okay. Uh, did you already go south? Yep. Okay. I already got the, I did the whole forest already. Got you. Shut up, I'm warning you. Oh, God. You know, you know what? Right. I'm not, I'm, I'm kind of hit or miss on Zach's new voice. I enjoy the voice actor quite a lot. He's fun. Um, but like, you know, I'm kind of a tied up with the old voice as well, but I only hear the new voice say that line. Oh, do you want to buy more seeds? Yes, I will. Do you know how many more we Just need? buy a shit ton. Okay. I normally buy like 80. Hmm. Buy a bit more if you want. Because I think we'll get two more harvests out of it. Ugh, one leak. I'm waiting for that double thing to kick in for the leaks. I literally I know. Got, like I pulled up, uh, what are these? dandelions. I pulled up dandelions earlier and I got like two on this one, two on the next one. <clears throat> I'm just you, finding dandelions today. <laughs> imagine you selected this quest at the end of spring. Oh my god, no. I got two leaks today, so that's good. So we just need four more. And the greatest thing is, is by the time we're going to get those two more, or those four more, then our other thing is going to pop up, and then we're going to... Mm-hmm. Four episodes, luckily, don't have to put emotional damage drawing on any of those. I hope they'll bring joy to anyone who decides to give them a try. Thank you. Oh, speaking of giving a try, Mike and I watched um, a Studio Ghibli movie I don't think either of us had seen before. Uh, yesterday called Only Yesterday. It was cute. Very good, like, slice of life, but very, very cute. Uh, I'm going to age the uh, lava eel row. Okay. Because right now it sells for 380 and I know it can get higher. Which one is that again? Uh, I think it came out, like, early 90s. Um, and it was a young woman in her 20s um, uh, kind of getting in touch with her childhood self in a way, maybe. Uh, it was a really cute one, uh, cute movie, very chill to watch while we were just like running around in Minecraft. It's a very like, it's, it's essentially just a, a, a woman reminiscing about the past. Yeah. And you, you get to see all the differences and stuff. But the, the funny thing is, is that the movie is written in like the 60s. Yeah, so like it's her childhood was the 60s. She's in the 80s in her present. And I think the movie came out like 1991. Yeah, so like just like some of the, the things that are happening in it. For instance, I, I'm not going to judge anybody if you had to go through this growing up. But like in the, the well, we're not rec we're not used to it anymore these days is at the dinner table, after the father was done eating, he lit up a cigarette at the table in front of everybody. Um, there was a scene really early on, and again, 80s workplace in Japan where uh, people were smoking in the office while working. And it's like, oh, different. <laughs> different. I haven't watched yet. Yeah, exactly. That's, that's why I wanted to watch it. It was a nice watch. It's very much more like slow paced slice of life compared to like spirited away you know owl all of those but it was a good watch still i i find that the older i'm getting the more that things like that speak to me but yeah we got the flute block i don't ever use those i i'm gonna put it where i put all my stuff <laughs> i'm gonna see what crobus has today
Um, and remember, if you see a green on a tree, you can hit it with a pickaxe and it'll knock the green off. Mm hmm. Um, uh, from up on Poppy Hill. Is that not one of the very, very, very sad ones, or am I thinking of a different one? I think the last new one I watched before this one was uh, when Marnie was there. That one was pretty good. That's a Oh, lie. other than the boy and the hair, and we there saw we that go. in theaters. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that. Well, okay. Sorry, I shouldn't say that's a lie. Lying is intentional. Mm -hmm. That wasn't a lie. It was just a misspeak. I will admit, with the Studio Ghibli, I prefer the more fantastical. Mm hmm But, you know, you can't always get what you want. I have, like, my favorite. You know, Kiki is one of my favorites. Howl is a favorite. Spirited Away is a favorite. Um, but I also have a soft spot the older I get as well for, like, the more slow-paced ones. Um, Whisper of the Heart is another favorite. And Riku's voice actor is the main boy in it, so... <laughs> Kind of special. Isn't sad. I think the one I find is Grave of the Fireflies. I think I get those two confused. So maybe I'll check out from up on Poppy Hill. Um, we're doing pretty good. I gotta figure out where I'm gonna put the barn. Princess Monaka. I think I need to give that one another try. Mango. I, I saw it as a kid and I didn't like it very much. Um, that and Castle in the Sky. For some reason I just was like, no, don't like. Yeah, because Castle in the Sky, Tales of Earthsea, like those would be very similar. Yeah. Um, uh, maybe I'll put the animals down here. It's kind of out of the way, but, like, it's a nice big area. They got a pond. We'll see. Oh, uh, grass. Or, uh, golden size. Sorry. Grab that. Also, I think I just dealt with all of our recycling. Side hit. <laughs> Oh, tomorrow's salmon berries. Oh, nice. And we can finish the dye bundle. <clears throat> if you wanted. That's just the iridium bar, yeah? Correct. Okay. We have nine iridium bars, by the way. Doing pretty good. And we can make one more. So technically we could, I think, yeah, we, we have enough for ten. We could get some, I usually do pickaxe upgrades. Yeah, we can get a pickaxe. I wonder if it'll do both. <laughs> yeah, we uh, we may or may not have we a legitimate. A, a small hiccup in the game that no one will ever complain that happened. Oh, actually, maybe I will watch that one sometime soon. Which one? From up on Poppy Hill. Is it one of those little sappy ones again? No, no. Apparently, it's not sad. At least. Um, but yeah, I've been, I've been looking for some, some sweet Studio Ghibli comfort. It's, it's almost, it's almost like that one type of, uh, anime thing that I found where it's, it's supposed to be uplifting and nothing too stressful. Yeah. It's a strange subcategory I've found. Linus wants a quartz. Okay. That's easy. No problem, buddy. I'll get you a quartz. Oh, 
And you cry easily. Yeah, no. I I uh, tend to avoid movies I know ahead of time will make me cry. So that is good to hear. I'm not crying. You're crying. You know what movie got me really bad and I wasn't expecting it, chat? I think it was because I had changed medications at the time. So I was just like overly emotional. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy 3. Mike couldn't, like, he was like, why are you so upset? <laughs> oh, yeah, no, that, it was sad. It, it was really, uh, no spoilers, but little raccoons get me, man. Would I be fired if I said I never watched a Ghibli film? You would not, Max, but I would encourage you heavily to watch them because they're beautiful, animation-wise, and they're fun. And their food. Oh my god, their food. <laughs> The way they animate food is not fair. Like, I will, out of any animation studio, I've never seen a studio focus so heavily on how food is prepared. Always. Like, they've never let us down for how their food is prepared. I think my favorites... Actually, I think my favorites come from the same movie. Um, other than Kiki's... Or um, House Moving Castle, the breakfast scene. Other than that with Calcifer. Um, both are from Ponyo when they're having, I think, like, milk and honey one night, and then they have, like, ramen, I believe it was. What about Spirited Away? Oh, God. I don't know what half the food is in that movie, but it looked good. Did I? What? I took the quest for Linus, I talked to him, and then I didn't give it because I was thinking about food. Oh, I gave it to him already. <sighs> it's fine. What hurts the most? <laughs> I know, Max. It's crazy. I like how your side of the room looks all prim and proper, and my side is just all like. You have an axe and a pitchfork. <laughs> you gonna get in bed? I'm in bed. Make all your bacon burn. There is a starter cookbook, yeah. Already, friends. Unfortunately. Uh huh. Unfortunately, y'all know what time it is. Gotta wrap up. We made it halfway, just over halfway through spring, I guess. We're halfway there. Whoa. Living on a prayer. <laughs> He's like, are you going to join in or what? Um, Thank you all so very much for hanging out today. If you are new and you feel like dropping a follow. That scared the shit out of me. I didn't know what that noise was. Um... I'm live usually every day except for Thursdays and Fridays. I am playing Stardew for the foreseeable future because, of course, Mike will not be back tomorrow, unfortunately. I'm hoping he'll, you know, be able to join us again next Saturday. If not, it's cool. <laughs> so Squidward on a chair. The, the quest we just got. Uh-huh. Like that mail that you have right now. Evelyn wants a leak. <laughs> of course she does. Evelyn, she wants all the leaks. <laughs> Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and raid Glam. I know she's doing like a big like streamathon this week, so I'd love to help support. Um, if y'all would like to copy down a raid message, that would be a very, 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 very nice. Um, have an amazing rest of your day, though, everyone. I hope y'all have a good day. Um, stay safe, enjoy some Stardew, and uh, I will see you all tomorrow. Bye bye. Good boy.